what's up beautiful people listen darama welcome to the channel today we have this very interesting video it's about the cheesecake factory lady and yeah i'm excited to check this video out let's check it out Girls. Okay. Tell them I said hi. Yeah. Wow. Mm -mm -mm. Let me just get the door for you. Okay. He got me at the Cheesecake Factory, y'all. I ain't getting out this car. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Wow. Yes. Uh, would you want me to open the door for you? Look at me. Are you? You're recording me? Yeah. Yeah. This is the Cheesecake Factory. Okay. This is the Cheesecake Factory, y'all. Uh -huh. What's the problem with that? Exactly. This is a chain restaurant. Who takes someone that looks like this to a chain restaurant? You want to talk about it? I'm, I'm fine with talking about uh -huh. it, even in front of them. Oh okay. yeah, I want to talk about it. Yeah, come okay. on, get up on in the car. Yeah, we are gonna talk about it. Wow. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. So, so yeah, let's talk about it. Let's talk you, about it. So you expect a man to go all out on the first date? Is that right? I mean, you're supposed to look at, I mean, when you take out a beautiful woman <laughs> and you're courting her, okay, because I, I get courted. So mm -hmm. you're courting her, right? You're supposed to take care of her. You're and supposed to cover her. You're supposed to protect her, cherish her, treat her well. Right. Yeah. And, and I, to do. I agree. Not I, I went into factory. this date as I expect, uh, with the expectations for myself. To keep you safe, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. to respect you, mm -hmm. uh, to pay for, for your food, of course, pick you up, of course, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. just treat you like a gentleman, uh -huh. which I believe I have. Yes, done. you have, sir. I mean, you, yeah, and, you've been pretty and then, nice, but I mean, and then, cheesecake factory. I, on the other hand, have certain expectations for a girl I go out with. Yes, on the first day, exactly. I expect her to be respectful too. Mm -hmm. I expect her to be cooperative. Yes. Mm -hmm. and, and at least, you know. Uh, what did I do that wasn't Go, Girl, you I have a very shitty me, attitude. Like, What's that? Like, uh, when we were walking to the car, uh, you wouldn't uh, put your hand around my arm or anything like that or hold my hand or anything like that. I mean, it's too early for that. Okay. I yeah. don't know and you. I yet. can respect that. I can respect that. Okay. When uh, I got to your apartment to pick you up uh you didn't want to invite me in i can respect that too Just, we're not again I mean, I don't we're not know there yet. okay but you know him enough to and go then, eat for free but i, I mean, mean i feel like i'm doing everything i'm supposed to do as a woman but i, I mean, got myself all made nothing up nothing wrong with the cheesecake factory yeah right yes there's a lot wrong with what the is it what factory. is wrong look girl at, well look at i mean look at my plan where we were gonna go originally See now that's that's where that's where we should have went. All right, right there. Call See, him. Call him. No. No, you don't deserve Maybe it. No. You don't yeah. deserve I it. I specifically you told you both yesterday and this morning that I'd come to pick you up at four a.m. Mm -hmm. at four p.m. Right? Mm. And I got to your place at four p.m. You didn't even come downstairs for another hour, and so I was waiting downstairs I for an hour. 
right. but I wasn't expecting for work to take me so long. I got home a little late. And like I said, I don't know you well enough to invite you up into my apartment. And that is not possible. And that's why I'm saying, I'm thinking, okay, if we're not there in the relationship to, you know, meet uh, at your apartment, then maybe we're not ready in a relationship for such a huh? nice, fancy uh, restaurant. Exactly. Area. Especially if I'm paying for the whole thing. Exactly. Which I'm still willing to do. I, mean, I would have been. Okay. But if we're late, I mean, I told I mean, you we twice. Wait, it wasn't that late. I'm you literally watching. left your place at the time the reservation was supposed to be. Oh, okay. And I specifically yeah. said four because maybe we could get there early and even get, have some time to get to know each other uh -huh. while we're there and while we're in the parking lot I mean, we, waiting for a reservation we can still get to know each other isn't there another restaurant you no go to you don't deserve going to another restaurant I, mean, I, I literally you, you don't said. understand look at me i cannot go in the cheesecake factory abomination I, I, I will die that's okay. embarrassing eh? listen i as i said i have very <laughs> specific certain expectations oh, for no. I hey! Tiova Jiru. I and maybe we're not right for each other. At all, you're not too. So respectfully, I'm oh, gonna just drop you off. Drop her oh. off. The, let her get out of the car. What's that nonsense? Yeah. I'm not. So you just want to call it a night? Exactly. I mean, yeah. isn't there some kind of compromise or something? Uh, Compro with it. I'm sorry, y'all. Uh, but I, I, if I don't feel respected, mm -hmm. I, I am mean, not gonna go through I mean, with the rest of the day. And block her, please. After this. I mean, you are serious. You're really leaving. Before Uncle. Yeah. I mean, you didn't want this place anyway, right? Exactly. I mean, I, mean, I understand that I was late. I understand that. I understand. Now you understand that, that you are I late. Been a bit more cooperative. You no, have, you are you going home. Points. That's why I'm willing to compromise. Go to your house. Are you sure you want to go home? Yes. Uh, go to your house. I don't have a lot of rules. I don't have a, a lot of expectations for a first date. But I've Before I go, you should be, you know, one go cheesecake factory. Oh so, my God. I'm sorry. We're dropping you off home. Exactly. <sighs> All right, whatever. Well, I mean. I guess I, I understand. You got to do what you got to do. Hmm? Well, I'm sorry. I, I understand where you're coming from. Hey! Eh? First of all, you don't want to go in. You're, it's the way she was like, uh, 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 like she owned the car. You don't want to come out. The guy was just being respectful. He was a gentleman. The minute you started put recording somebody, there are so, lots of people that don't want themselves to be um, on social media. They, they don't want the social media attention. What if he's that kind of person? no respect no regard for somebody else you put up your phone to record you're not doing mm, 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 mm. you're not coming you will get out of the car what's that nonsense get out of that my that car and trek home since you say you don't want to go to the cheesecake factory you're looking for a nice restaurant you don't have the right attitude to match the rest re nice restaurant of course you need a ready-made man but you don't even have the nice attitude to match that lev level of niceness. This man was just too nice. Honestly, he was just too nice. And these are the type of people that will say they've not met a nice person. All the guys they've been meeting, they, um, they, they've not been nice, being nice to them. But of course, how do you expect to meet a nice person? But you don't want to return the favor. You have a very disgusting behavior. And this is what the society would be promoting. And they think it is okay. You're looking for a nice restaurant. you dressed all made up, according to you. To you now, you dress all made up, look good, glamorous for a nice restaurant. Go. So, you want him to take you to the nice and better restaurant, but you're not ready to go with him to the one 
you're seeing yet first. These are the people that social media will tell, oh, unless the man takes you to, um, unless the man lights candle, do all of the um, date restaurant things you see on social media, on uh, TV, or on social media, all of that one that society is placing, unless they, they do this one, you, um, then that man is not there. <laughs> it should not match his pocket, Abby. So you expect the man to go take you to a restaurant that he cannot afford. And he's the one paying for it. You're not even paying for it. Girl, you could have taken yourself to a better restaurant. But of course, you're, you need a man that will take you, treat you nice. But you cannot even be respectful to the man. I want an independent lady. To fear quoi? Don't, this is not real. This is not real. Anybody that will see this nonsense attitude and think it is real and say condone or support this thing, eh? I am ashamed of you. This is disgusting. It's so disgusting. What? It was even nice to take you back home because no, you will come out of my car if you no book Uber back to your house. Make I know what in Kosa. What's that? It was even nice being a perfect gentleman to take you back to your apartment. First of all, you were late, one hour late. Now you are now apologizing because he's taking you back home. So you know, you know what you were doing in the instant. It's the craziness for me. These people, they know what they are doing, but they just want to make it and paint it to be like, oh, the person is at fault. And it's a good thing that you recorded this same thing and you are seeing where you are at for because of course this type of people they will not even take accountability for their actions at all to her there is nothing she has done wrong oh. she did not see anything that she has done wrong at all these are the type of people when eventually they meet a man and the man has everything all good and going for him then the minute everything falls or falls they will run they are only there for the glamour the man has to offer but once the man has nothing again they are not there to support him more they are just there for the instagram like instagram click tiktok and the craziness and all of those social media things but once he doesn't have any of those things again they will run this one hey, hey god i bear go Things are happening in this world. No. I have a lot to say. But if I continue, if I go on, this video will not end. But let me know what your thoughts are in the comment down below. What are your thoughts about this and this particular lady's attitude so far? I really love your thoughts in the comment down below. If you're a guy and this particular thing was done to you, how would you react? I really love your thoughts and your contribution to this. I mean, I put a great different opinion regarding subject matters or topics like this. And I really love you to share your contribution to this. You can share other useful information you think might be really helpful. And until next time, see you in the next video.